Hello friends, welcome to Code Sutra. Let's solve lead code problem number 435 non overlapping interval. See, the answer to this problem is a very simple answer, but the approach or the intuition is the main thing in this problem. How do you crack this when this is asked in an interview? How not to confuse and how to arrive at this solution? And at the end of the video, I have also shared very similar problems to this. So do consider watching till the end of the video. Now in this problem, we are given intervals. These are the four intervals that are given. This can be written in this format also. Now, what do we have to do? We have to remove the minimum number of intervals to make this non-overlapping. For example, this interval can be removed and all of these intervals are non-overlapping, right? For example, the endings can overlap with each other. For example, one of the event is ending with two, but other event is starting with two. That is fine. The ending and the starting time can be same, but it should not go like this. That is from one to three. So if we remove this, we will be having three non-overlapping intervals, right? So the answer in this particular case is just equal to one. Now let's take an example. Let's take this example and this can be transposed to this matrix and let's just observe how our brain is trying to solve this. Okay. So how many number of intervals do we have to remove in order to make this non-overlapping? Just two, right? Which are those? We'll be removing this and we will be removing this. But how did we arrive at this? Right? For example, your brain is doing a scan from this side or is it doing a scan randomly? It is doing a scanning from this side, which means we have to sort it. Now, you might be thinking we have to sort it based on the starting time because that is what the first intuition that comes to the mind. But let me add few more examples. That is, 4 comma 5 and 5 comma 6 right if we add this example 4 comma 5 and 5 comma 6 now do you have to remove this intervals or this intervals so your brain is actually not sorting it based on their starting time but we should sort it based on their ending time because we don't want to choose this event we want to remove this so that these two events can be taken or say there is an event which starts from one and ends at six do you want to take this though it has the best starting time do you have to take this no right right because it has the end worsting worst time or the greedy approach is that the end time we want to end an event faster so that we can attend the next event so the array has to be sorted based upon their end time so that is the first idea now what happens when the array is sorted based upon their end time let's take the same example and sort it out based on their end times okay i will be taking the same example and i will be sorting based upon their end time now which is the one that is having the best end time this is the one that is having the best end time that is one comma two comes into play what is the next thing that has the best end time 2 comma 3 these two are done now 5 is the least end time that is 4 comma 5 now you can just go on about it with the same 4 comma 6 5 comma 6 and uh, we have one more event that i have written 5 comma 6 but we can just remove it now since all these events what is the thing that we have to observe we have to observe that uh, only after this event has ended you can begin with the next event so can these two events be accommodated yes right so our answer is still zero can this event be accommodated yes can this event be accommodated no right why because our end time is five and this event cannot be accommodated because the start time is four but can this event be accommodated yes so in this case we'll be just removing one interval from the answers or the interval to make it non-overlapping. So which is that interval we will be removing? I have uh, missed 3 comma 6 because it has the one of the worst end times and there will be 3 comma 6 also here which should not be included once again. So our answer will be 2 in this particular case. Why 3 comma 6 is also not able? Because we are starting an event and the end time of the event it is 5 and 3 comma 6 and 4 comma 6 can never be included so the answer will be 2 in this case so what did we do first thing is we sorted it based on the end time next is we will have an end time initially what will be the end time the end time will be minus 
integer dot min value that is the minimum end time then from the first event what we will do we will check if the start time if the start time if and only if it is lesser than the end time or the previous end time or whichever the end time that we are tracking if the start time is less than that that means we cannot start the event so in that case we will be adding our answer so let me dive to the pseudo code first thing is we will be sorting and we have initiated the answer to one end time is equal to minus 60,000 why it is given in the problem that the maximum range is minus 5 into 10 power 4 so I have taken 60k then for all the intervals what we check is we check if the start time is less than the end time if it is we cannot accommodate this event or the interval so we are increasing the answer else we will be changing the end time finally we will be returning the answer see there are very few similar problems that has a quite a similar approach and this is based completely on intervals these are the problems and most of them are medium level problems and we have a dedicated telegram group uh, where we will be discussing these solutions and we will also be having a few workshops so if you are someone who is interested in that please do consider joining the telegram group which uh, whose link i have shared in the description now let's dive into the actual solution which is actually a few lines of code in fact it's five lines of code first thing we are sorting it out then we have answer n time and what we'll be doing is the same thing that we have discussed if the start time is less than the end time we'll increase the answer finally we'll be returning the answer thank you for watching the video please do like share and subscribe